All right, what's on the bench? Another antenna. This is an ADS-B 1090 megahertz standard head aerial 2.5 to 5.5 volts, <laughs> 2.0 dBi receiving aerial SMA receiving antenna for self-made aeronautical experiments. Yes. Uh, where do we, how do we get it out? There we go. It's, it's a nice design. It says it's uh, made to be at 1.09 megahertz, version 1.0. Got it right the first time. Look at that though. The center conductor comes up and it, it feeds this section, uh, which is solid. Uh, I think this is solid copper up here. And it, it's not just this piece. This piece is exposed, but I believe it's, it's yeah, it's solid everywhere. It's stitched together too. So it's one big piece of copper up here that, that there's a hat and then it has this folded section here with like these radials and uh, the ground feeds that and then it's got kind of a coplanar uh, waveguide type of thing coming into it so yeah looks uh, looks pretty cool it kind of looks like a stubby vertical with some short radials but all folded up into a coaxial thing so yeah pretty strange um, yeah let's uh, let's put on the VNA All right, well, there you go. We've got one big dip uh, going between 900 and 1.2 gigahertz. Let's put the marker where the dip is. And the dip is at... Uh, the dip is at 1.68 or 1.7. No, 1.67. 1.67, so not, definitely not 1.09. 1.09 is, uh, 09 is over this away. So, I mean, it'll work there. It's okay. It's still at minus 18, so it's okay. Um, but it's not exactly where I thought it would be. Uh, let me put my hand in, in front of it or anything. That moves the other way. I don't know. Uh, but let's take a look at Smith. Back. Display, format, Smith. There we go. Whoop, as expected. All right, well, there you go. Antenna for the day. Uh, 10, 1.09 gigahertz. Uh, yeah, don't know what it's used for, but I like it.